Whether you're heating them, secreting them, or just plain beating them, eggs are a staple of many people's diets, which is precisely why it's important to have a trusted advocate in your corner to crack open these gadgets and find out which ones are worth putting in your basket. This here is known as the whisk. It's a device that'll scramble your egg in its shell. But is this thing just a bad yolk, or is it actually worth its hefty $35 investment? After removing the contents of the box, we've got ourselves some mangled styrofoam, the whisk itself, as well as a power adapter and a silicone ring that I'm sure we'll need later. Oh, sweet, we've also got some instructions covering the usage of the device as well as some procedures for boiling pre-scrambled eggs. After you plug it in, unscrew the top off to reveal the egg Gravitron beneath. After that, go ahead and remove that top layer of the egg holder. Now just head over to your carton of lovingly named eggs and select one. After placing it into the seat and screwing the lid back on, it's time to give Andre here 3,000 revolutions per minute. You start the process by double tapping the power button. Now we do want to note that you'll definitely want a dark iron grip on the whisk. Once it's powered up, this thing has a mind of its own and definitely wants to go take a disastrous dive off the counter. Once completed, the whisk will power down and the light will stop blinking. We pop the egg out and head it over to our preheated burner to see what kind of prizes we'd won. Oh, there you have it, a perfectly scrambled egg without the use of additional utensils and the perfect opportunity to show off our multi-use spatula set. Breakfast is served. Considering this device's simple design, we thought it'd be pretty easy to whip up our own version using a drill driver. So we put a socket on top of the driver and we put the egg on top of that in a nice little pillow. We then affixed everything together with some rubber bands, making sure that the egg was snug and secure. To mimic the whisk perfectly, we utilized a high DPS spell rotation going from super speed to full stop and then back again, repeatedly. It's important to mention that you don't really want to go full tilt boogie when you do this. We got a little overzealous with our demonstration, and our boy Dennis flew the coop mid-spin and splattered against a nearby table and TV. It was pretty clear to see that the egg was not scrambled at all, which means our little invention was a bust. Getting down to it, if you've got chronic pain in your hands or a disability, this thing could be awesome and really save you some time and effort. But the fact that you have to stand there and hold it in place really prevents you from doing two things at once, and you might as well just crack an egg into a ball and scramble it with a fork. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the stage, Egg Stripper! And if you want to see her flash, and you gotta put some cash in, so be generous, fellas. <clears throat> Sorry, the Egg Stripper takes all the hard work out of peeling your previously boiled eggs by shaking them up and down inside a container. It boasts an impressive five egg capacity on the inside, but that's certainly not all. You can say goodbye to that old shake weight that's collecting dust, fill this thing up with concrete, and give your deltoids a good old workout. The first thing out of the box is a set of instructions in the sultry, unscrewable egg stripper. After pouring in a bit of water with a dash of vegetable oil, we dropped three chilled eggs inside and shook the stripper vigorously until my song was up. Going in to check the results, it would seem the egg stripper did its job and a little extra on the side. Our eggs came out shell-free, although they looked a bit worse for the wear. As a bonus, it would seem the shells were also conveniently collected at the base of the container, making them easily disposed of. Now that we know that three eggs work all right, we'll try out their claim of deshelling five eggs in a 10 second period. Keeping the two foot rule in mind, we gave them a nice hearty shaking. Although we did manage to crack most of the shells to the point that they'd come right off, the results weren't nearly as good as the three egg test, which leads us to believe that this claim is blatantly false or they used pigeon eggs in their testing. All in all, if you're looking for that special gift for someone who has it all, maybe a $20 stripper can be that holiday magic that they deserve. Oh, look there, it's Mr. Sniffles. He's a hilariously disgusting tool that's used to separate egg whites directly from their yolks. Once you remove the contents from the box, you'll have a ceramic separator, as well as instructions on how to perfectly extract your drippy delights. To put this guy into action, all you've got to do is crack an egg or two directly into his weight and noggin. When that's taken care of, just give it a nice little tilt reminiscent of a water pitcher, and your egg whites should begin to 
delicately seep from his nostrils. If you find that you're having a hard time getting the egg whites out of the container, just give it a shake and you should see some results. Just one shake though, any more and you're playing with it. Mr. Sniffles is no toy. When the flow from Mr. Sniffles' nose begins to stop, you can tilt him back up and it'll ideally retract right back through his nostrils, although we managed to get a little dribble on his lip. One thing worth mentioning is that this nasal cavity definitely has a maximum capacity. If you overload the container, not only will it start to leak out immediately, but you'll also notice that you'll end up with a reduction in flow. If you peer inside here, you can see that the yolks are actually blocking this poor guy's nose holes. All right, now you've seen Mr. Sniffles complete the task that he was built for. However, he has other talents up his uh, nostrils. By slapping Mr. Sniffles on the pedestal that he deserves, you can pour juice right down his noggin and fill two glasses at once for your unwitting guests. All jokes aside though, Mr. Sniffles has got a job and he's doing it and doing it and doing it well. But that's not going to stop us from showing you how to make your own version right at home. Just grab an old piece of Tupperware, a Sharpie, and a drill. First, and this is very important, draw the best face you can on the Tupperware, paying extra attention to include gigantic nostrils right near the bottom. After that, go ahead and drill those nostrils out and remove any excess plastic. And just like that, we've got a homebrew version of our own, lovingly dubbed Mr. Sniff with the lyrical gif. All you gotta do from here is crack the egg inside and gently rock it to and fro, and make sure that nothing slows down your flow. So that's it. If you're the type of person who likes quirky kitchen assistance, go ahead and pick Mr. Sniffles up. He's guaranteed to give you a cheer on a rainy day, and he really makes things happen when it counts. As as far as breakfast is concerned, a boiled egg is hard to beat, and that's why we're proud to present the Copper Chef Perfect Egg Maker. Not only can it make up to 14 eggs at the same time, but it also doubles as a hands-free way to make omelets or poached eggs as well. Coming in at around 20 bucks, this novel invention can really expedite your food prep, whether it's for a quick bite or just making some last-minute hors d'oeuvres. After removing the contents of the container, we were met with the Perfect Egg Maker itself, a couple plastic dishes, a measuring cup with a piercing nail on the bottom, and while assembling the egg maker for use, hidden at the bottom there's also another molded ring to use as an extension when you're making a whole clutch of eggs. We're going to start by pouring water into the measuring cup until it meets the line marked hard. To ensure even cooking, we advise that you should pierce each egg on the bottom before boiling. But be careful not to press too hard or you may find yourself doing a little cleaning before you even finish. After that, just pour the water into the bottom and put the eggs into the tray. Once that's taken care of, just put the top on and fire up the machine. After about 15 minutes, your eggs will be done and the egg maker will shut itself off automatically. Great! As you can see, our results peep for themselves, as the eggs turned out perfectly with ideal consistency. As far as poached eggs and omelets are concerned, just flip your measuring cup around to reveal the additional markings on the rear. Fill it to the appropriate spot and then pour the water right into the bottom like you did before. Go ahead and place the egg dish on the lower rack of the device, add the eggs, and then put the top back on. About eight solid minutes later, you should have a photogenic omelet worthy of your horrible Instagram. You can check out the poached eggs too. They turned out with a unique presentation. Everything's said and done, this little gizmo exceeded our expectations and does a decent job to cement the perfect egg maker as a solid purchase for anyone who wants to streamline their breakfast routine. When it comes to cooking eggs the old fashioned way, overconfidence is a slow and insidious killer. Enter the color changing egg timer, a $3 kitchen helper that takes the precision out of cooking your breakfast. Taking a peek at the packaging, the egg timer is encased in a rigid plastic shell, with the rear depicting what the timer should look like when it's time to snag your eggs right out of the water. Let's dive in head first and toss this thing into the pot with some eggs. We'll see what we can cook up. Once the water starts to heat up, the timer may start to do a little shimmy. This will happen just as you notice a yellow ring encroaching upon the red area of the timer. Since this thing works by measuring heat as opposed to time, the time required may vary, although the end result will remain the same. When the yellow ring reached the marker that said soft, we went ahead and yanked it right out of the water to check our results. After giving it just a couple love taps with the spoon, it's evident that the soft boiled egg could have used just a moment or two more, since the egg whites are still glistening and slightly undercooked. We also tried this with our medium egg and a few moments later to spectacular results, achieving perfect whites in a slightly runny yolk. As for the hard boiled egg, we just left it in there until the red area was merely a faint ring and it turned out excellently as well. 
So if you or someone you know loves a nice egg in the morning, but you don't want to shell out the cash for the perfect egg maker, well, the color-changing egg timer is a cheap way to step up your game. Just give it a few tests beforehand to make sure you know what you're doing. Well, thank you so much for being excellent viewers. Be sure to follow us on MySpace, Friendster, and Daily Booth, and we'll see you next time. Also, if you enjoyed this one, here's another Egg Gadgets video for you to watch right now. Job's done.